Hey guys, welcome to Subdizon. In this video tutorial, we will try to fix an error. This error says GD library extension not available with this PHP installation. So how this error occurs, I will show you. I have created a form for you. This form is created using Livewire. So I will try to upload some information using this form. So in the field of name, I will type e-learning and we will choose a photo. This error occurs when you try to upload file or image. So I will use this image and we will try to upload this image. You can see we got an error. This error says GD library extension not available with this PHP installation. So now we will fix this error. First of all, you have to go to your driver in which you have installed your local server. In my case, in drive C, I have installed my local server which is XAMPP. Now go to PHP. Inside PHP, search for php.ini file. So I will go to this file and now in this file, we will search for, we will press Ctrl plus F. And now we will find for extension is equal to GD. Okay, great. As you can see, I found this line and we will remove this semicolon from here. Now save this. And now I want to tell you this semicolons make this as a comment. So if I will remove this semicolon, it means now this line is uncommented. So we will remove this. We will remove this too. We will close this too. And now we will go to our XAMPP server and we will restart this server. Okay, now if I will try to resubmit this form. Okay, this is saying that this page is expired. So we need to refresh this page. Okay, actually, I need to log in once again. So I will log in fastly okay as you can see brand information is successfully uploaded if i will try to edit it once again and now i will try to upload another brand information suppose i will take this laravel api thumbnail And now if I will click on update brand, okay, great. As you can see, our brand is updated successfully. And now if I will refresh this page, you can see brand is updated on every single nav bar and sidebar. I hope this video will help you. If this video helped you, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos. Thanks for watching.